Cause nation, San Bonan Bafetu and welcome back to Football Trends with me. OQB hey, Bafetu, I know, I know. It's been a while since Nakala own niggas I'm updates. But anyways, I'm here. I'm here, Bafetu. I will try to give you as much as possible that I have. Because if Nkumbulaga actually I've asked you guys uh do you prefer for me to give you more update in terms of other PSL teams or Sistik and go Kaiser Chiefs? And majority of you voted we stick to Kaiser Chiefs, but we can try to expand, you know, just in Nigeria, even the young boys in Jeruti Wenzagala and Labo. And on today's video, I'm happy to say good things of in Nigeria, I won't get all my details. But of course, before I dive more into the details, please do make sure to like the video or subscribe to the channel. And also, of course, you click a bell notification so that next time when I post in your video you get notified now what do I start buffet to well obviously I'm going to give you everything in terms of the DSTV disc challenge obviously I do have some information uh, also Zognia's another player that has moved to Europe but first things first buffet to I just want us to touch quickly on O goalkeeper coach Elias Mzoki which is lies Mzoki I'm not too sure in terms of pronunciation in Zulian and Klega the other day but anyways Kumbulang I've reported about him with he went back to Mauritius, uh, you know, to to uh, honor his late mother, which is Hassan Monsour. I'm not sure in terms of e spelling La Paine Tunisia. And yeah, he had to bury her. And now, as I'm speaking with you, Omchita has flown again. Uh, now he is going to help oh, Babuka, Babuka or Babuka, uh, not to concede against uh, Itimi Ake or Mohamed Salah. I'm not too sure if Mohamed Salah will be playing because they're going to be playing against Egypt. So, Melenji, I'm training Mfana. I vote to be strong, but even though, even though, to be honest with you and fair, Nyamtando Mohamed Salah Bafetu, uh, he he's a player of Itimi Frostanayo, which is Liverpool, Nyamtando Liverpool, uh, European Football League. Uh, to be honest with you, Umchida he performs very well, Magalapa with Liverpool. But when it comes to national duty, hey, as we are changing, as I Mohamed Dengmazio, maybe it's because of environment and the players he's playing with is not used to, but. Hey, Yazin has put me in love of too. Let's go back to the other news. So, looking at a DSTV Disc Challenge Buffet too, because you guys requested to say no more as niggas a reserve team, you know, the under uh, under squad young uh, Ginto, you need to know. So, currently, uh, we're going to be looking at the under 23s. Uh, they are sitting at number one spot, La Pagulok. They have four wins, one draw, and one lose. Equal difference there on I La Pagu number four. They have 13 points, which I'm not too happy because if Imamelo the Sundowns were to, you know, obtain three points, they are going to, to be moved out of that spot. So they needed to do better. Uh, especially Ulea Gamez all the way they played against uh, Istelis unfortunately I could not watch the game but anyways hopefully they played very well because I'm happy with the performances Gabon Klemulefe so it looks like he's improving a lot and uh, goalkeeper coach it looks like he has shown something in terms of Mfana yes I'm not mean but it looks like so far because if we take a look at him and truly speaking uh, Google list your choice the first team is on the fourth fourth I think fourth place with Mangambiza so that he can be able to play for the senior team but so far Ali with DDC uh, the reserve team I can say he's doing very well because uh, they say he has improved in terms of good communications and now he's quick on decision making and also he managed to keep clean sheet with some beautiful saves so that is something that I think we have to upload and you know give credit to the goalkeeper coach Nayum Fana or for trying to show what he wants to improve so that as Okonukbamba is Kundala Pana because Kobole, we have Ufia Kintuari, we have Bruce Vuma, we have U, 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 Lona, this guy, the, the white guy, Brandon Peterson, and then Nge Uze and Nge Omfana. So it's going to be a hassle for him with Taza Konukbamba in a bond spot. But, but for me, I think he's a future investment and hopefully he's going to give us something. And then also moving on, we have U Dylan Shepard by feature. So it looks like Dylan Shepard and Novella Komalo who is the coach of the reserve side. It looks like they are partnering up. So they have a core working relationship. Now they are partners uh, doing the same thing, uh, being the same head coach for uh, the under 23. So 
that is something that I'm not too sure what you guys are But hey, I'm not too sure Dylan Shepard buffet too strong. I'm sorry, I'm saluta because looking at him, uh, it, it looks like he's changing positions within the club. There's no way to your puma or your hamba. He's just there, you know. He's just there changing positions. Being up, being up, being up, being up. I'm not anti for it. But anyways, uh, but but he ma basho over the Kumalo is happy, you know, to share the responsibilities with the coach Dylan Shepard. Maybe means in the series like Ubelula. I don't know. But anyways, uh, that's what I've gotten. And then moving on to the player that got signed. To Europe, I have to. This one is very interesting. I know I should have spoken about it a long time ago, but anyways, I'm here now and so there's this player. Uh, to. we had a young midfielder by the name of Steven Mendes, uh, 16, very young, uh, great midfielder, and yeah, honestly, uh, before the transfer window, Ival, I think 826 August, Umfana managed to join uh, a team. Uh, partially owned by Zoltan Ibrahimovic. I'm not too sure if you're not familiar with Ibrahimovic, but come on, if I'm Mazi, go and search Lapayana Google, Google, and then you will know who to ban Ibrahimovic. And yeah, looking at the club player, Jonile, its name is called uh, Hamebi. I'm not too sure if the pronunciation is correct, but I think it's Hamebi. I F Ikujima Lapayana Al Sevaskan which is a top tier football league La in Sweden. Currently Itimia Kona it's on third position as I'm speaking with you. So for him to be able to join uh I move from here to uh Europe so smoothly and swiftly is because he has dual nationality and also his agent was impressed by the matter of how uh okay zamdawang jr handled the whole situation the whole deal as totally so he says he has a portuguese passport so he was able to move before he turned 18. our agency has always championed uh, players getting to europe as soon as possible if you look at what my dad did back in the day with steven Pinar, benny mccarthy and how he helped uh, Borussia Dortmund to sign Christian. In all cases, they came at a young age, which gave them maximum time to adapt and to develop at the highest level possible. But with the more cumbersome world permit regulations in Europe and FIFA's transfer regulations being pretty jail against non-Europeans, it's become extremely difficult for South Africans as not many have dual passports. Hermabi has experience with young players from abroad and has a very good setup in the academy and we are based in London which is close by so we'll be with him on a regular basis. All credit to Chiefs as well for them making this deal happen. I'm very appreciative that Keiza Jr. and the rest of the technical team were reasonable with their transfer demands. They saw the opportunity for a young boy to go over and develop. It's a testament to their academy, which in my opinion is one of, if not the best in the country. The struggle we have faced recently in South Africa with young players is that clubs tend to look short term and subsequently price them out of those European moves. Unfortunately, we are not in the same place that we were a few years ago where South Africa was respected as a football powerhouse on the African continent. Our players were desirable and there was isn't as much competition of players coming from abroad into Europe. Nage Umetu Moore, which is the agent of Steven Mendes, known as Stevie G. But for you, hopefully, Umfana is going to give us much. But hopefully, the experience that is going to gain that side is something that is going to help him, you know, to grow individually and as a player. Nai, I'm here, I'm here. I can do this to be much better because experience, you know, football that side is not the same as football this side. But anyways, Buffet, I think this is it. This is what I wanted to give to you. If I have something interesting later on, but if there's nothing, Buffet, to a so challenge and see. But tomorrow, we're going to be seeing the draw of a black label cup. Hopefully, we're going to get a team that Kaiser Chiefs can beat on my 4 5 1. Unless we have a little bit of sundowns in the world and the pirates, which we know so far, so far, nobody is happy with how uh, the referees of this country, you know, are officiating the matches. But anyways, Buffet 2, I think this is it. Thank you so much for watching. Later on with something new, if there's something.